Hey, welcome everybody to uh, the little webinar on the Terra Adapter. What we have is a tripod, you know, a tool with many names, uh, you know, artificial, high directional, portable anchor, tripod. I mean, the thing is, it's something where we have to negotiate an edge or go in a confined space. This is something that's going to come into play. Iterate the most important thing when you're rigging up these high directionals is uh, making sure that everything is pre-tensioned before you put any kind of a load on them. Uh, you don't want them to move at all. Uh, once it comes time to uh, get the system in action. So the pretension back ties uh, and tying off of the legs, that's where you see all the rigging coming in there. Um, you know, using little mini haul systems, things like that. Just little, uh, little tricks of the trade to make sure that you keep that high directional uh, completely 100% uh, in a neutral state. One of the key components of this tripod is the back leg. You can, you can set the front legs up, lock those legs into place, and then the back leg you can leave free as a lazy leg, adjust it where you need it to go to get everything set up the way you want it, and then you can lock it into place so it doesn't move and gives you a lot more stability, but you can rig uh, with the lazy leg. So here's a close-up of the, of the upper part of the, the head and the top leg. So we have, uh, we have lash rings. Lash rings, um, you get two lash rings with a unit. Uh, it's a base unit. The lash rings can be pretty much put anywhere on the, um, a perf tube that you want. So they can be put above the head like you see in this configuration. We can drop those down to lower parts of the legs. You can put those down almost down to where the feet are at. Anywhere there's a, a hole in the perf tube, the lash rings will go. This is the key to the tripod. The main thing that makes it so versatile is being able to set this thing up. And then once it's set up, you can adjust it based on what you need by adjusting each leg individually um, for wherever you want to be in the, in the system to make it the most stable, safe system that you're using. So remember, uh, when you set this thing up, there's going to be different forces and different configurations, as you can see this drawing here. You know, if there's no room, we can take this leg and go up over here. For some reason, this leg could drop down. This leg could swing up as well. So what this leg will do, so will these legs here as well. And again, if you, if you want to just use your imagination and, and make that a 3D uh, triangle, um, you know, your resultant is going to be inside that triangle. Even with that third leg up on the wall, that inside of that triangle would basically be where your resultant is. So if you pull outside of that, uh, that footprint there, um, basically that's when you get into a top lane situation.